Hello everyone, man. This is Jay Integer, and um, it came to my attention that a lot of people don't know how to install the plugin, the um, Full Buckets uh, Frequency Shifter. So this is a video on that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna link this in the other video. But if you're watching this video separately, um, it'll still pop up. I won't like unlink it or anything. Okay. So uh, like I said in the other video, um, I wasn't gonna do it in that video, but I guess if people asked for it, I was gonna do it separate one for it. Either way. So. Oh, whoops so um oh, i lost my train of thought okay so i said you need to download it from full buckets website so i'm gonna bring this, bring that up down here and you can see it um here's the here's the link for it it's actually html site which uh kind of dates it but you know what uh this is what you need and you're downloading this one the download the frequency shifter bsd windows so you'll download it i'll just redo it um you click on that it'll let me and then Okay, I'm gonna blur a lot of this so I don't like, accidentally give away any of my crap. So, you'll just save it and then it's gonna download, it'll run through its thing. Go ahead and open that up and you're gonna look in here. And what you want is this one the freckshifter.dll. Uh, you don't want the 64 bit one because 64 bit ones, from what I've seen from the other video, don't work with Audacity. So, you're gonna want this one. Either way, um, I haven't seen. He did it with WinRAR, WinRAR, but the way I do it is just right click, extract all, and you're going to find this Audacity folder. So go to your, mine's my C drive, uh, C drive, program files, x86, and then I'm pretty sure you should have this. If not, like wherever you keep your Audacity at, it's, one in, it's, it's in one of these two. So you're gonna click that, then you're gonna go to um, Audacity, and right here in Plugins, um, go ahead and do that. And you see I already extracted it here, but just click the Plugins, and then this shouldn't be here. It'll be empty, but you'll be in the Plugins folder. Go ahead and select that folder, and you'll have this new um, this new file directory, file address. And you go ahead and extract that. I won't do it, but just hit Extract. It'll start extracting everything. Then, if you want to check, just go to your C drive. Program files, uh, x86, and go to Audacity and plugins, and you should see it. it. It'll be it should be the Freck Shifter folder. If not, then it might be just uh, any of these ones. So okay. So after you do that, go ahead and run it. Run Audacity. Then you're gonna go to Effects. And you're gonna go to Add and slash Remove Plugins. This is how you're gonna add the plugin into Audacity. So it won't be this one. Remember, you don't you don't want the 64 one. You want one that's kind of, it's just gonna be called Freck Shifter. So this one just minus the 64. And I already I already um did that one, so it should be around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Found it. Found it. Okay. So this one says Frequency Shifter, but when you're doing this for the first time, it'll come back as Freck Shifter. F R F R E Q Shifter or Freck Shift. Pretty sure it's Freck Shifter. So just click that, then it'll say um, it'll say new, like these ones. It won't say enabled yet. Oh, crap, I lost it again. Ah, right, here you go. Then you're gonna go down here, click enable. So yeah, then click okay. Then it should pop up right here in the, in these, in these ones down here. Then you just open it up and follow those steps. Then you can freaking die, die, double to die. Um, as much as you want after that. Um, okay, this one was just for installing the plugin. Um, I hope the other video is easy to follow. If not, then I guess leave a comment on this one to see if I can need to explain things a little more. Alright, thank you. Uh, goodbye.